this video I will show you how to set the border layout for the controls on the frame. Click the new project. Set the name and do not check the create main class checkbox and click finish. Right click the default package and add a package. Name the package and click finish. Now right click the newly created package and add a J frame to it. Name the J frame and click finish. Now you have a J frame, you can resize it. You can add different controls from the swing control. I will add a panel from the swing containers to have a background color. We can set the color for this J panel. Now right click on the empty area of the J frame. Here you can see the set layout option. Click it and then click the border layout. Okay, a border layout container arranges and resizes its components to fit in the five regions, which can be north, south, east, west, and center. Each region may contain no more than one component and it is identified by a corresponding constant. So you can only put five buttons on the border layout and they will all be arranged in this way that you have something on the north then you have on the south on the east and west and, and, and the center now you can place the buttons like this any side you want to place it on the left right center top or bottom So like this you have all your 5 buttons on the border layout. So now when we run it you can see it gives you something like this. Now we can set some properties of the border layout and we have uh, two properties horizontal gap and vertical gap so we can set this to 10 now you can see it has more the buttons have more gaps between them now we can set the size of the frame so that it doesn't show us that small you can select this minimum size property and we set width to 600 and height to 400 so now when you run this you will see it will show you the size that you have 